Hello and welcome. Today, we're diving into the public beta of MX Linux 25, codenamed Infinity. If you're a Linux fan who cares about stability and modern desktop polish, this one's worth a look. Quick summary. MX25 is built on Debian 13 Trixie and ships in three main flavors, XFCE, KDE Plasma, and Fluxbox, each updated to recent releases. The standard builds use the Debian 6.12 LTS kernel, and the advanced hardware support, AHS, builds use a Licorix 6.15 kernel for newer hardware. What's new? Top highlights. MX Tools has been ported to Qt6, giving the distro's configuration utilities a fresher, more consistent GUI. There's a new MX Updater tool replacing the old apt notifier, which aims to make update notifications cleaner and easier to manage. The live system from AntiX has been updated to work better with SystemD, widening compatibility between SystemD and Sysfinit editions. KDE Edition Notes Plasma has been updated. The beta ships with Plasma 6.x. And, important for Wayland adopters, Wayland is the default session in the KDE edition, with X11 still available from the session chooser. If you use KDE, expect Wayland to be the path they're pushing. Fluxbox edition. The Fluxbox release receives several usability improvements. More configuration options, revised panel layouts, refreshed root menus, and updated Rofi slash AppFinder settings to make launching apps and customizing the desktop easier. Installer and firmware slash security changes. The installer now includes a replace function to help swap an existing Linux installation more cleanly. There's also support for 64-bit UEFI secure boot in the standard signed kernels. But note the AHS slash Licorix builds do not support secure boot. So if Secure Boot matters to you, pick the signed Debian kernels. Practical notes for testers. This is a beta release. Great for testing new features and reporting bugs, but I don't recommend running it on critical production machines. Back up before you test. If you want to try it, grab the beta ISOs from the MX Linux download page and consider testing in a VM or on a spare drive first. Bottom line, MX25 Infinity keeps MX Linux's philosophy. Stable Debian base, friendly user tools. While modernizing the desktop stack and tools, Qt6 MX Tools, MX Updater, Wayland in KDE. If you like Debian's stability but want more up-to-date desktop polish, this beta is a solid preview of what's coming. If you'd like, I can make a follow-up video showing the installer walkthrough, a KDE Wayland versus X11 demo, or a quick tour of the new MX tools. Tell me which one you want. Hit like, subscribe, and drop your questions in the comments. See you next time.